fish on. Hey guys, the technique I'm using today is bottom bouncing crankbaits, believe it or not. I just got one here. So the cool thing about this technique is uh, you can use it in combination with uh, your spinner rigs and all that kind of stuff, whether you're using leeches or crawlers. So you can do the same, same speed by bottom bouncing floating crankbaits. So I like to use around that four inch uh, crankbait, four inch, four and a half, stuff like that. You can use Rapalas, Phantoms, Smithwicks, and all kinds of baits like that. They gotta be floating though. So I'll show you the setup right away. I'm gonna show you this walleye and uh, see what you figure. Is that walleye? Walleye? Bottom bouncing crankbaits, guys. Really cool presentation. I'm gonna show you more. You guys just hang on. So, guys, when I'm bottom bouncing crankbaits, these are the basic styles that I use. Um, that right there is a Smithwick floating, right? That's a Bagley. And everybody knows what that is, that's a Rapala, original floater. So as you can see, they're all basically the same length, right? And I pull them behind a bottom bouncer, just like you do any spinner rig. And I put a seven foot lead of 12 pound fluorocarbon behind a bottom bouncer, so that that bill has enough room when that uh, bait floats. But as you're pulling, that bait will wanna try to dig so seven foot fluorocarbon between there and your bottom bouncer. And uh, you can catch walleye using original floater, Smithwick, Bagley, Phantom even has some baits. Really cool technique guys, you guys should use it. It'll help you put more fish in the boat. So you just wanna keep tension, rod tip up all the time, right? Take it easy, it's not a race. So with that seven foot lead of fluorocarbon, sometimes you gotta lift your rod tips quite high and make sure your net's extended. negative they're laying right on bottom the odd one marking the odd one but they're pretty much right on bottom Bottom bouncing crankbaits. Pretty sweet, huh, guys? Nice walleye. That one's a little bit, that one is uh, 19 and a half. No, sorry, 20 and a half. Twenty and a half. Fish on, guys, right here. They are taking the crankbaits today. Woo!
have a good fish here, guys. So I'm just using a seven foot St. Croix. Medium power, fast action. Yeah, this is a good fish there, guys. Woo. Guys, I think we hooked into a dandy. Hope you're ready for this. Oh yeah, she wants to go. This is the coolest thing about fishing, is letting these beasts go back. Look at her, she's raring. Gone. So what do you guys think about bottom bouncing crankbaits? <laughs> Pretty deadly, huh? You can put a lot of fish in a boat, bottom bouncing crankbaits. That right there is a crankbait clip. So it's more round, that way your crankbait can roll and do its action. Um, that there's your basic Rapala original floater. Doesn't work at all. <laughs> See the teeth marks? Doesn't work at all. Don't 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 buy. Don't use it. Doesn't work. <laughs> so yeah, there's a crankbait clip, and it makes for easy uh, switching between baits, right? You can just pop it off just like that. Grab another one, throw another color at them, and away you go. So. Got another one on guys, just cranked it. Crankbaits, I tell ya. <laughs> so much fun. And you always wanna keep that forward momentum of the bow going, just so that it uh, helps with that drag, keep them pinned. Here we go. Another one, guys. Just hammered it. <laughs> one thing I love about walleye fishing is is all the techniques you can use to uh, to catch them. Basically, to trigger those bites get that reaction strike this is this that's exactly what this is reaction strike bottom bouncing a crankbait um, more aggressive than than some kind of live bait rigging right here we go here we go let's 
right there. Go to the front of the lip. Don't be scared to switch up them colors either. If they're not going. I think just going through the colors. Another one, guys. Just move spots a little bit here. Saw a glimpse in there. Yeah, he's a nice fish, guys. Nice fish. Comes off in the net. So I got. Nice fish. Hey guys, thanks for tuning in, watching my channel. Remember, subscribe, hit the link at the bottom. I really appreciate it. And uh, I'll continue showing you guys techniques and how to use them to catch walleye. Until uh, next time, I'll see you on the water. Take it easy.